Fascinating. According to the blueprint, Sean Rose is building an explosive battery unit for a Link 4 smartwatch. The charge appears to be email triggered. The unassuming target checks his messages, the virus triggers the charge, and boom. Very clever, not to mention devious. The resident hackers have installed the software trigger on one of their phones, and here is the punchline. Rose himself wears a Link 4. Of course, you don't hold a candle to Maya Parvati, the training director. And I was wondering about it. So what's this I hear about a training accident? That would be Burgess. Hey there. Sharpshire. Point man in the Mexico huh? operation. Huh. Got clipped by a ram or something? The team training from Saturn. Guy. The guy Ezra Berg has tied up in the interrogation room. Rose, terrorist turned insurgent. Excellent, 47. I dare say Rose is about to get a taste of his own medicine. This sounds promising. The militia received a large shipment of nitroglycerin this morning, which is now stored at the munitions depot. Apparently, Rose himself plans to apply and test the gel as soon as a sample is ready. What? Possible intruder. Sweeping area. Over. That is Sean Rose, terrorist turned insurgent. Well done, 47. When Rose comes back, he's in for an explosive surprise. The weapon doesn't lie. The weapon is... I advise you to say it's a... So what's this I hear about a training accident? That would be Burgess. A battering ram has injured one of the strike team, Point Man by the name of Burgess. And according to those militiamen, Maya Parvati oversees training. Sounds promising. I suggest you infiltrate the strike team 47. Perhaps you can relieve the hapless Point Man of his duties. Sharpshire. Sure. No Point Man in the Mexico operation? Huh. Got clipped by a ram or something? That's what I'm saying. Watching the Broncos was like a break.
spirit. Wait a minute. Oh, because they're such elusive creatures. Don't you dare mess up this fucking day more than it already is. Hey, bro. That is Maya Parvati, I'm Sri Lankan back. assassin well, turned well, pirate turned insurgent. Bag. Any broken bones? Wounded pride. That's all. Good to hear. All right, head over to the briefing area. We'll resume in a moment. know this by heart but in case amnesia has set in here's the sequence advance to the car with haste eliminate the passengers retrieve the briefcase extract got that and remember speed and accuracy is the name of the game all right now go pick up your weapons and get in position move out Please proceed. Pretend I'm not here. Not a problem. All right, let's go again. On your marks. Ready, set, execute. <laughs> Is Sean Rose, terrorist turned insurgent? Nicely done, 47. Parvati won't know what hit her. Speed and accuracy, but coordination needs to improve. So this test that Rose has planned seems kind of cruel, doesn't it? I mean, I'm no softy or anything, but it feels excessive to me. She's got it coming. Penelope Graves is still new to this outfit, and it looks like Rose is going to test her dedication to the cause. He's arranged for one of the communications technicians to act as an outside agent. The tech is supposed to show her an Interpol badge and escort her to the slurry pit, asking her to betray the militia. Might I suggest a last-minute recasting, 47? And nobody can switch sides like Graves and, and just expect to be accepted. Tests are in order, man. Yeah, sure, I get that. But playing on her past with Interpol like that? I... I don't know, man. But I just hope the technician knows how to act. She used to be the enemy. Right? I don't have any sympathy for that. I'm sure he'll be fine. He's got the badge, right? Yeah, he showed it to me over by the tent. Rehearsed his lines, too. He's taking this pretty seriously. Should be in the clear, but hey. It'll be interesting to see if she takes the hook. And not to mention how far she'll go. You think she'll order us to be removed? If she does, I got a 45 cal with her initials on it. I hear ya. Oh, 
Oh, you were at Jordan Cross's funeral, huh? Uh, I was at things we used to. Hold on. What the? Find out what that was. Acknowledged. Show yourself. That is Penelope Graves, acclaimed anti-terror analyst. Strange to see her as part of this crowd. All right, guys? Penelope Graves. We need to talk. You're... Uh, what is this? I'll explain everything at the slurry pit. It will be in your best interest to do as I say. I understand. I'll see you there. I have to say, it's a beautiful... What? I... <laughs> Ezra Berg, legendary Mossad operative who specializes in chemical interrogation techniques, is here at the compound to interrogate a prisoner. My notes indicate he's set up a makeshift drug lab in a garage, and it looks like he's spending a lot of his time in the basement. Could be an opportunity there, 47. Freaking the man. Ask. What the hell are you talking about? I was just at the security station watching the feeds. There's this creepy guy interrogating the hostage. He wears like a 3D printed mask. Oh yeah, that must be Berg. Oh yeah, man, his interrogation techniques? Totally just out-of-the-box stuff, like truth serums, drugs, that kind of thing. But uh, none of the rough stuff. No, they don't like to mark up their patients, so to speak. Those Mossad boys like things clean and efficient. Bird. Ezra Bird? Yeah. Yeah, man, I've heard of him. Chemical interrogation expert. I guess it's his makeshift lab they've set up. Word is he can make anyone crack. Oh, man, you don't know the half of it. I mean, the, the stuff this guy's into, get this, drug-induced hypnosis, memory wipes, subliminal mind control. Shit's like witchcraft. Glad I'm not the prisoner. Christ, this next-gen warfare makes my head spin. You know, just point me in a direction and tell me who to shoot, eh? Oh, no, 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 no. You'll get to shoot. Don't worry, there'll be plenty of that. Well, whatever Berg's up to, we better work fast. Rose is itching for some Q&A. I have to say, 
It's a beautiful piece of work. So what's this I hear about a training accident? That would be Burgess, the sharpshooter. Point man in the Mexico operation? Huh. I surrender the fuck. That is Ezra Berg former Mossad interrogator. His services are in demand at the moment. The guy, the guy Ezra Berg has tied up in the interrogation room. He's one of the enemy's couriers. Well done, Fox Ezra. That's With any luck, the perfectionist Ezra Berg will want to examine his notes closely to, to figure out what happened. A weapon shows you what? Intriguing. According to Graves' ledger on Sean Rose, he is hypersensitive to the effects of drugs, in particular hallucinogens. Last time he tried, it triggered a nasty psychotic episode, channeling his fear of germs. Interestingly, the ledger also contains a record of his most recent OCD attacks. Desk, grandfather clock, and faucet. Hmm. Rose appears to smoke cigarettes when he gets agitated. What if... Ah, strange. I just watched an interview. Surprise open! Tons of respect for you guys. Thank <laughs> you. 